Hey, I'm Jill. Welcome to my channel. So you may say, so soon? Yes, I'm back already because guess what? I got a mix and match box. Let's do this. So I have never had a mix and match box. I'm very excited. We will see what's in here. Um, mix and match box is sort of like Stitch Fix. It's a subscription box. You pay $25 and they send you a bunch of items. Um, the thing is, I didn't know when it was coming. It said like, it can be anywhere from like two to three weeks, I think that it comes. And I ordered it probably two or three weeks ago. And I finally got it. The fun thing is, I have no idea what's in here. So with Stitch Fix, you can cheat and you can look. You can sneak a peek. Um, but I don't know. I don't know what's in here. So I'm a little nervous. All right, so I'm just gonna open up this envelope really quick. There is another mailer in here to mail back what you do not want. There is a little thing that says, thank you for choosing mixandmatchbox.com to style you. We hope you love it and a price sheet. And just a bunch of other random papers that kind of talk about subscription boxes. There's a couple different ways you can do it. You can do a uh, monthly, however you want to do it, as much as you want. It's $25 to send you surprise items. You can also do, um, a 105.99 monthly subscription where you take a chance and I guess they send you like two to four pieces that um, you just keep I think and it's supposed to be worth like twice that I think or something like that so yeah let's get started so it comes in this cute little bundle with a pretty bow it looks very mini mouse mouse ish and it says thank you for letting us style you So big. There's so much in here. All right, I'm gonna start at the bottom. Oh, this is so pretty. Okay, so it's a blue top. Oh, it's like, um, oh, okay. I thought it was gonna be like a cold shoulder, but it's not, it's just sleeveless. And it has like a slit, but that blue is so pretty. This is by Hayden, Los Angeles. $44. Okay. We will try that on. Um, we have a blazer here. Extra, extra large. That might be a little big. By Liverpool. I've heard of that brand. This looks cute. I like when blazers don't have buttons. But that looks like it might be a little big. We will see. It's very soft and just really nice. Um, I do not see the price on that. We will look that up later. As if I don't have enough camo lately. More camo! So I have like this um, gray camo. Oh, it's so soft. I got it at Marshall's a couple days ago. Or no, yeah, Marshall's. This looks really cute though. Bomb bomb. Short sleeve. Camo. Tie at the bottom. Super cute. $32 and soft my favorite oh polka dots I love polka dots this is so cute this is another bomb bomb $28 it's just like a soft tee that's really cute and another bomb bomb 
I mean, they're soft, and I told them soft, so. Vertical stripe, has blues and teals. A little bit of like a cream and a white, I like that. Next is another bomb bomb. <laughs> this just must be my brand. Um, oh, this is cute. It's like kind of like a cold shoulder, but then it has like some ties. I like that color. And then last is a pair of jeans by Liverpool. The Slim Boyfriend. I have always wanted to try a pair of Liverpool, so I'm really excited that they sent these to me. All right, that's the stuff. So I am going to try this stuff on for you and then we'll talk prices at the end. All right, outfit number one. So I'm gonna try this from a little bit higher up. I was filming it from below before and I think this might show a little bit better even though it's getting really dark in here. It might be a little orange, but you get the point. All right, so this is the bomb bomb top that has kind of the cold shoulder and the Liverpool jeans, which I like them, but I'm so used to skinny jeans that having like a boyfriend kind of wider leg jean is sort of strange for me. This top is really cute though. I really like the color. I'm gonna try the blazer on with it. I would love a blazer for like over like t-shirts. Okay, so it's not huge. It does have real pockets in it that you kind of have to push through. They're sewn together right now. fit really well. Next outfit. Okay, this is the second bomb bomb top. I don't love it. And I did put my regular jeans back on just because it's what I feel comfortable in. I don't love it. Here is the third bomb bomb top, the navy polka dot. This one's definitely cute. I like this one a lot better. This is more my style. All right, this is the fourth bomb bomb top, the camo, the tie at the bottom. I don't love this just because the tie is weird. Like it doesn't stay tucked under very well. I love shirts that have ties like this though. So I do like that. And I like how all these shirts are longer, which is another thing that I asked for. So I'm happy that she listened to me. I do like it. It's definitely my style. I just don't love that this keeps and I don't like when it's not the same fabric underneath. Okay, and this is the last one. This is the Hayden top, and it's way too big. I love the color, and I love flowy tops like this, but this is just 
so huge. I love that it's long. But yeah, too, too big. I'll be back for a recap. Okay. So, we're going to go through prices really quick. All right. This blue Hayden top that was entirely too big was $44. Camo Bomb Bomb is... $32. Polka Dot Bomb Bomb, $28. Stripey Bomb Bomb, $30. Pink Shirt, $26. Liverpool Jeans, $79 and the black blazer by Liverpool was $98. So obviously Liverpool stuff was a little more expensive. Didn't love it. Thought the blazer was a little bit too big. I would love a structured blazer to go over like t-shirts. That would be so fun. Um but yeah, I just think it's not the right fit for me. Um, total for this is $332 if I kept everything. Uh, discount would be 25% off, $83 off, and then the total would be $249. I'm not going to keep all of it. It says keep all six or more items. So I don't have to even keep all of them. Let's say I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight things. No, seven things. And yeah, I'm not keeping it all. What I'm leaning toward is the lavender pink shirt. And I think the blue navy polka dot shirt. Not sure. What do you think? Should I keep them? Should I keep one or the other? Should I just send it all back? I mean, these shirts weren't bad prices. Like I said, they are really soft. I do really like that. They were long, which I always also like. And you know what? They're made in the USA, so that's a plus. Rayon and spandex. That's the materials. So not super high quality, but... I mean, they feel good. They feel thick. They feel soft. And I love that. So, I don't know. Let me know your thoughts. Comment, uh, like, subscribe to me, and we'll be doing more of these soon. I have another Stitch Fix on the way. I think that's coming in a couple weeks um, with my girl Hannah again. And I just did a new subscription today um, for an app that's called... Uh, I forget, but I will, um, link it below and let you guys know, um, what that is all about and yeah, we'll see you next time.